Thank you for showing your name. Gracias por enseñar tu nombre. I see Henry and Belen. Nice. Belen, what is that? Peanut butter. Nice work. Good reading. Wow, you guys are great readers. I see Miss Archie and Miss Banfield here. Hello. Oh. What does that say, Leonardo? Zapatio. Zapatio. Wow, que bien leíste, amigo. Nice reading. I love it. All right. You guys are readers. You just don't even know it yet. You can read lots of things. Okay. We're going to go ahead and get started with our next activity. I know I promised you a picture. I'm still looking for it. So I will find it before we're done today. Um, but for now, we're going to start our picture. Um, oh, Miss Archie, show us your picture from when you were a little girl. With my mom. <laughs> with your mom. Oh, my goodness. That looks like your daughter. Oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, wow. That is beautiful. Thank you for sharing, Miss Archie. You're welcome, Mrs. Pokins. Okay. And I will find the picture of me as, as a little girl. I will look for it, don't worry. Okay, next activity. Um, we are going to be doing a color hunt. Una búsqueda de colores con Miss Banfield. So I'm going to get that going. Here we go. Hello again, friends. We have a fun activity for you. We're going to go on a color hunt in my yard today. Before we go on the color hunt, I want to share this book with you. In English, it's called Oh, the Colors. And in Spanish, it's called De Colores. And this book is from the song De Colores. Some of you friends probably know this song. Maybe some of your families know it also. Let's take a look at the book. It says, ¿Puede usted encontrar los colores en el libro? Por ejemplo, es azul, este es rojo, amarillo, verde, morado, blanco, café, negro y anaranjado. Vamos a buscar los colores en la historia. De colores. De colores se visten los campos en la primavera. De colores. De colores son los pajaritos que vienen de afuera. De colores. De colores es el arco iris que vemos lucir. Qué bonito el arco, hay iris, ¿verdad? Y por eso los grandes amores de muchos colores me gustan a mí. Y por eso los grandes amores de muchos colores me gustan a mí. Canta el gallo, canta el gallo con el kiri 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 ki. Canta la gallina, canta la gallina con el cara, 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 cara. Canta los pollitos, canta los pollitos con el... Y por eso los grandes sabores de muchos colores me gustan a mí. Y por eso los grandes amores de muchos colores me gustan a mí. Do you see all those beautiful colors of the rainbow in our story? We have some beautiful colors on our table. Let's take a look. We have nice colors. What color is this? What color is? 
Oh, here it is. Verde. In English, we say green. How about this color? Right. Anaranjado. In English, we say orange. Let's see. How about this color? This one is azul or blue in English. How about this color? Amarillo or yellow in English. And this color isn't on our dice. I just found that out. But we have this color, morado or purple in English. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go on our color hunt. And I'm going to collect my cards to help me remember which colors I need to look for. Maestra. All right. So come with me and we're going to look for these colors. The first color we're going to look for is red. It says red. In Espanol se llama rojo. All right. Come follow me. We're going to come around to the side of my yard. I remembered I have something red on the side. Friends, if you look right through there, do you see those beautiful flowers? One, two, three. Look and see. They are red. In Espanol se llaman rojo. Flores rojos. Very good. Our next color we're going to look for is yellow. In Espanol se llama amarillo. Come follow me. Let's go over here. I think I have some other flowers. Ah, uh, you know what? I don't think I do. So I'm going to come over here and look. I have my markers on the table. And look at this. Is this el amarillo? This is the yellow one. Very good. Let's see what other color I find. Azul in Espanol se llama, in English we say blue. Oh, look at this. I actually have my scissors from a project I was working on, and the handle is blue. Es de esa, azul. Let's look again. Es de esa verde. This is green. Do I have anything green on my table? Hmm. Oh, thank you for your assistance. Some new scissors that I found have green handles. Very good. Let's take a look again. And then how? Orange. And look at this. Right here on my marker box, we have the color orange. Es de anaranjado. One word to say in Spanish, anaranjado. And lastly, we have Morado, or purple in English. And look at this. I have a cute little notebook. Looks like a purse, doesn't it? And it's purple. La bolsa es morada. It's a purple purse. All right. Sorry, friends. Anaranjado. And lastly, la bolsa es morada. It's a purple purse. All right, and that concludes our color hunt. You can do this at home. You can make some pictures with the colors, and then you can find objects that are those colors. Thank you for joining me today. Bye bye. See you again. Six thirty five. Okay, so Miss Banfield took you on a color hunt. You found lot, she found lots of colors around her house just outside. I bet you can do that and play a game at home and look for the colors. Maybe you can play with your brother or your sister and say, let's find something red. And both of you go and look for something red. Or maybe you can say, let's find something blue. <gasps> Liliana found a yellow toy. Nice work, Liliana. I see it. All right, friends, I promised you a picture of me when I was a little girl, and I found it, but it's on my phone. So that is the picture of 
This is me when I was a little girl. And I'm with my mom and my dad and my baby brother. So that's my picture from when I was a little girl. What do you think? I was little like you. All right. Misty Saros, did you find any pictures yet? No? It's okay. I had to look. It was hard. <laughs> okay, friends. Um, so you can maybe do a color hunt around your house, and we'll see you at 1030 for our read aloud. Um, it's a funny story today, so I hope you're ready for a funny story. I'm going to unmute. You can say bye to your friends. Is it in English? Oh, the story is in English today. All right. Bye, friends. Bye. 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 B